everybody so we are close to valentine's day and as i said in my previous video i am gonna put up some valentine's day um stuff i mean at least one or two but i will okay so this is one of the videos i will put up um and it's just a makeup and eye here let me zoom it's just an eye makeup look really simple um use the face I'm still working on it um if you see me looking over here it's because of my mirrors over here so you know okay so let's get started so this video won't be long girl because I don't know just cuz okay so let me prime a lid okay so um we're gonna start you guys know this palette right elf is like five bucks or something i don't know but it's this elf thing and then um the first color we're gonna be using is the first one which is this one this white color so we're going to be using that one for the whole lid so that the color that we're going to put um, there will pop and we're going to be all the colors I'm going to be using are from this palette except one which is going to be the black okay so next color so your lid should look like this. Next color is going to be this um, pink salmon color. Hopefully you guys can see it's It's barely noticeable. Oh, here, let me zoom in a little bit more. It's a little noticeable, not really, but hold on. Okay, there we go. Ugh, should have adjusted my camera, you know, but I didn't. So we're going to be using that color. And just put it in the lid. If you have a skin tone close to mine, which is like a olive kind of a skin tone, this color would look so good on you. This like pinkyish, salmonish color. So next, we're gonna be using the one next to it, which is this light brown mixed with the bottom one, which is um, a darker chocolate brown. So. We're going to use that in, um, in our crease and like just buff it out and yeah. If the color of the salmon -y color um like fades or something, just go back to it after. So after that we're gonna put a black in like to define our crease. And just use any matte black, it doesn't matter. As long as you define the crease. Don't 
There we go. And then just blend it with a clean brush. Just blend it out. I know my acne is all up in the camera, but it's like... I'm trying to get rid of it. So it's going to look something like that, you know? And if it's too black, I just want to go over with the light brown. Just like that. And then go over with the salmon color so it can pop. I was, so, I was supposed to upload this video yesterday, but I wasn't home, so, yeah. So now we're just going to be using um, liquid eyeliner. And just do your, if you want to do wing liner, do it. If you want to do thick liner, do it. If you want to do thin liner, do it. Whatever you prefer. I just... I just do like an everyday type of eyeliner. I don't know. But if this is too thick for you, then then it's a thick liner. <laughs> and then just want to put some mascara. Use any mascara you want. Or if you prefer falsies, then go ahead and put your falsies on, girl. Just like that. Okay. Oh, and then put some in the bottom. Okay, let me put this camera a little bit down. So guys, okay, so we're going to move on. Um, the foundation and stuff, you guys already know. If you want to put a lip, I mean a cheek, cheek stain is better. So do that. But anyways, for the lips, I chose two colors. The first color is going to be this um, Nude. And this is by Femi Couture. So it's called Nude Kiss. And it's this um, nude color. There we go. I mean, I like it. Nude goes with everything. So that's one. The next. The next one is um, this red color by um, White and Wild Juicy Lip Balm. It's called Cherry 280C. Cherry? Cherry something. Sarise. It's just like, it's a lip balm, but, yeah. Looks good. And it looks girly. So... I prefer this because it looks more girly, looks more pretty, I don't know. But, you know. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.